Hey guys, so I wanted to make a video tutorial series um, walking you through how to create a MERN stack application. For those of you who don't know, that MERN stack stands for uh, Node.js and Express on the back end, uh, React on the front end, as well as MongoDB for the database. Um, hmm, looks like they added new stuff. And the application that we're going to build uh, is just going to be a simple voting application uh, that I built for Free Code Camp. But there is quite a few things that goes into creating it, um, as you can see here. The for the server, we're going to build a REST API to handle requests, and that we're going to call from the client side. And just to see a sample of it. Uh, we're going to start up the server really quick and while it loads and there we go so on the front end there's quite a few things that I added to it so it's uh, I have authentication which is a back end thing I believe it's been a while since I checked this and so authentication works and we're going to manage state with Redux so things like this are possible we also I also have um, React Router and just a little cool little Chart.js implementation uh, which is the best JavaScript framework well obviously it's React oh I already voted okay uh, let's see, let's make a new poll. We could, but we'll get into that in the actual walkthrough. I hope you guys enjoy, and I'm going to start making those videos now. Okay, so I actually forgot to um, go over prerequisites, but uh, before you start uh, this tutorial, you should have Node.js installed. Um, I'm going to be using version 10. And then also going over how to install MongoDB. Um, it's this part might be a little complicated, uh, but the instructions are pretty well documented. So just follow this. And then for my development uh, environment, I'm be using VS Code as my text editor, as well as well. I'm I'm using Mac, so I have a Bash terminal but if you're on Windows I recommend either getting git bash um, or commander because I'm gonna be using the terminal quite a lot so if you want to want to follow along you should get one of these two and then to test our backend we're gonna be using an application called postman and don't worry I'm gonna include all the links in the description and as a side note I'm gonna be using <coughs> um, the ES6 version or modern JavaScript. Uh, it might be a little daunting at first, but I'll try to be as beginner friendly as possible. And yeah, I think that's that should be it. <laughs> 